Joining us now, Joe Johnson, Pooh Jetter, downtown Bobby Brown from Overseas Elite after their big win over Armored Athlete to advance to the final eight. First off, congratulations. You know, kind of my first question, Joe, just curious what you thought of uh, your first experience in the tournament. I uh, thought it was great. I enjoyed it, man. Uh, you know, it, it was good to get out that room and, and finally get a chance to get out here on the court and compete with these guys. Uh, it was fun. And, fellas, just in general, I mean, you were the last team to play in TBT. Um, you know, the anticipation, I'm sure, around, the, around you guys just being in the hotel for days. Um, walk me, Bobby, you're shaking your head. Walk me through that. Man, just watching these games every day and then not being able to practice together as a team, uh, you know, talking in the chat every day, seeing each other videos to get a better feel for each other. It was, it was hard. But, uh, you know, we, we was able to get a practice in yesterday. Um, and get acclimated to everybody. But just watching games every day, staying in the room, not being able to go outside, it was tough. But uh, yeah, TBT did a good thing, a good job with, you know, all the rules and the tests and making sure everybody is good. So uh, I commend them for that. You guys have all had your own unique and different experience in the NBA. Uh, curious what the, you know, the skill level and overall pace of play was compared to when you played in the NBA in the tournament. Oh, well, definitely, I feel like it's just hoop, really. It don't really matter where you're at if you're in the NBA, overseas, China. It don't really matter. Um, but this is different because the money is on the line. So everybody <laughs> is going to bring it every second. Hard. So, uh, no, nah, it, it's really no difference. But uh, basketball is basketball. So moving forward, you guys are, you guys are the highest seed remaining. And you're about to play the lowest seed. Um, and the darlings of the tournament, you guys can say whatever you want about them, but, but they, have, they have become the Cinderella no, yeah. of, of the TBT. What are your thoughts on, uh, on the, the upcoming opponent? I don't think we can necessarily look at seed, man. Obviously, as you can see, it don't matter what seed you are, anybody can lose. So uh, we respect our opponent. We're going to prepare for him. Absolutely. You know, kind of my last final question, how much fun was it just being able to be back on the court playing some ball again? <laughs> wow. <laughs> fun. Like, wow. It's in the play. And we on ESPN, too. Yeah. So I was like, people don't get to see us. We be in Europe and China. Yeah. All they get to see is our IG highlight. <laughs> <laughs> no, but it, it was definitely fun. Uh, not even weird not having fans. You feel me? It was just, I just called a, a close scrimmage. Right. You know, so. You know, but just going up, you know, playing and, you know, and like I said, this was our first, like, second time really, like, I'm not going to say it's a practice game, but um, just us getting together. So, you know, it was it was definitely fun out there. All right. My last question for you guys um, before I let you guys go. Um, what's it going to take for you guys to bring home the, the championship and the million bucks? Greed and toughness. Defense. Yeah. We got to have it, man. We got to get stops. Got to get stops. Got to get stops. We got to assert ourselves from the start, be aggressive, and start to finish. We got to get downtown Bobby Brown a couple more threes, put the game away a little earlier. Uh, right, right. right. Yeah. That's coming. It's, it's coming, coming for sure. Yeah, that thing is coming. <laughs> All right. Thank you, guys. Good luck in the next round. Hopefully, talk to you again soon. Thank you. Thank you.